Hello Virgos. So uh, this is your bid month reading. I'm going to start with the general messages. Okay, universe, give me a three card spread and let's just see how for Virgos. Okay, peace. Universe, give me two more cards. Honesty, imagination, and friendship. Okay. Um, I feel like what's going on, I feel like there is some form of clarity. Um, probably there was a time, so this can go both, both ways. This, there could be a time where it was pertaining to a friendship. Um, someone was kind of being shady, okay? Um, however, I feel like this person's wanting to be honest and apologize. And I feel like you guys can still be friends with each other, okay? Now, if it's when it comes to a love situation, I feel like you guys are just seeing things exactly for what it is. Nothing more, nothing less, okay? And some of you guys are probably just going to be cordial with them or even friends with them, but not being back romantic. Okay, let's look at the romance angel. Okay, universe, give me a four card spread. So there is attraction. Universe, give me three more cards. Release your ex. Universe, give me two more cards. Passion and children. Gen energy is for giving and learning. Yeah. So here, it's going to sign in with the message um, for the general message here. You guys are just letting things go. Probably there was a lot of passion, but you probably feel like there's not that much substance in this relationship anymore. Universe, give me a four card spread. I'm going to just see you have for Virgos for the rest of this month. Okay, so there's expectation, false person, message concern, privilege lady, and there is a message. Okay, also, what I'm getting from this is um, hmm, probably this is an act from a long time ago, and they're having a baby. Okay, that's what I'm getting as well, or they, they got married. That's what I'm saying. I feel like you guys are just like forgiving the situation wholeheartedly. This is something I feel like that happened a long time ago, but you're finally um, letting go of any type of emotions that was still attached. You know, I feel like you've been physically move on, but there's probably there was some some form of resentment, some form of stag um, stagnant type of energy. You're removing that out of your life. Okay, so let's look here. Let's look at the tarot. Let's see if it's picking up on another message. Okay, Universe, give me a five card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? Universe, give me three more cards. Universe, give me two more hearts. Good. King of Pentacles in reverse. Seven of Cups. So first position, I got the Empress. Then you guys got the Strength card. And then the middle position, all these reversals. So Justice in reverse, Cherry in reverse, World in reverse, Sun in reverse. And then fourth position, Knight of Wands, Star. And last position, the King of Wands in reverse. I mean, King of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like with it's trying to stay with the Knight of Wands and the Star. Um... There is, there is um, an energy of clearing things out now, okay? Probably there was a time where you feel like you, you wanted to put it in the back of your mind. I feel like right now you're using this time of retrograde to just really clear things out completely, okay? To heal from it. Because um, this is relating to the past, something that probably was a lack of clarity, probably how you guys ended things was like was not clear or it was a lack of closure. I feel like you guys are making your own closure, okay? And you're moving forward. You are knowing what you deserve and what you are, like you're worth basically, okay? Seven of Cups, let's see what Seven of Cups is about. Universe clarifies Seven of Cups. King of Wands. I do see you have another option who's a fire sign. I feel like this person is older than you. Universe clarifies King of Wands. 
ace of swords in the verse okay this is someone who you don't see like that and i see why because this this is someone who either is a fronter or they don't like to um be completely honest yeah you don't see them like that okay but there's another option okay universe clarify the king of pentacles in reverse ten of swords in reverse seven pentacles in reverse yeah so yeah, I feel like you guys are just thinking about the past, but healing from it, okay? Not putting it in the back of your mind and not trying to ignore it. Universe, clarify the strength card. Universe, clarify the strength card. Seven of swords in reverse. So this fire sign could be a Leo. Okay, knight of wands. Yeah, <laughs> you don't see them like that at all. You just see them as someone who is a liar, um, it's a player. Universe clarify the inference. Four of Cups. Universe clarify four of Cups, Page of Cups, and the Yeah. So I'm just seeing you guys making amends with the past, forgiving, not carrying the, any heavy energy. There is another love interest here, but you're not interested in them because you just see that they're immature, even though they may be older than you. They have like this F boy, F gal energy. <laughs> Universe clarify the Knight of Wands and the Star. Universe Club had the Knight of Wands and the Star. Five of Swords, okay? So yeah, while you're healing from the previous relationships, previous connections, this is this player type of energy that's coming through, okay? So like I was saying, the sign, I feel like the newer person is probably a fire sign, particularly a Leo. Then the past could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, a Taurus, a fellow Virgo, a Capricorn, okay? These cards won't fly. <laughs> Some good to me a Cancer. Okay, or a Libra. Okay, let's look here. These cards keep flying. So face chakra. Your money, it's gonna increase. I do see the inference. So if you, there was any financial loss, I feel like you guys are gonna be able to um, recover that financial loss. Or probably you guys made a big expense. I see you able to save um, soon. Universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? So you got shadow. I feel like this is just you healing, healing the past, getting, finding your own closure, getting your own clarity. Then tower, destiny reverse. I feel like this is just you acknowledging the past. It was not meant to be. And page has been planning. And then the seven of cups came out again. Now the seven of cups does represent confusion. I feel like you are just clearing out any type of confusion. Okay, seeing things exactly for what it is. Universe clarify, um, choose wisely. Four of wands. Okay. And also you may feel like these people was never marriage material anyways. Okay. So let's see what else I'm getting for you guys. Universe, give me a four card spread. So there is Hodonis, okay, lover, <laughs> prostitute, mediator, wow, <laughs> okay, and mystic. So interesting, let me clarify. Universe, clarify prostitute, bully. Okay, this is someone who could, yeah, like I was mentioned before, they, this is someone who was never marriage material. However, you still had care for them. You still had love for them. And probably you guys are wondering why, okay? Like, why do you actually um, love this person or was attached to them, okay? Even though they was not deserving of you. Universe, clarify Hadanas. Martyr. Okay, so yeah, so I feel like right now you are going to be putting you first. You're going to take this as lesson learned, putting you first, not being, not self-sacrificing, not putting your needs last, okay? Then mystic. Some of you guys have been having dreams about this person. Okay. Let's look here. Okay, universe, give me a four card spread of messages that you have. For Virgo, so I'm gonna be a new Sagittarius. I want to say that for you guys. <laughs> okay, you're ready. Yes, yeah. <laughs> and then listen to your intuition and don't stop. Yeah, I feel like we're trying to say, don't give up on love. Love will find you. Look at that. Yep. 
romance is gen general energy okay so I'm trying to say do not give give up on love love will find you and I feel like it's gonna find you again when you are really aligned to your purpose that's what usually happens when you really align to your purpose it happens you meet your soul family your soul tribe you're just feeling good so just focus on you and focus on what you want um, in your life okay and just enjoying the process it's gonna find you so let's see what else I'm getting Universe, give me a two card spread of messages you have for Virgos. Saving the positive and boundaries. Yep. Yeah. So it taught you a great lesson. Okay. And that's what part of it was. That whole connection relationship was just more so a lesson. Okay. And then I got Inger as my secret alley. Again, I feel like you letting go of any resentment. Okay. And you getting your own clarity, your own closure. And that's going to lead to big movement. So Inger is my sacred alley. I listen to the messages with my anger and use it as a positive force for good. Savoring the positive. I allow myself the spaciousness of savoring, savoring delicious gifts in my life. And then boundaries. My clear boundaries will allow me to protect myself, nurture my intentions, and follow my true self. Okay. So that's the reading that I have for you, Virgos. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a person with me at queenforthetarot at gmail.com.